Hello everybody. Very, very interesting night. I am going to take a different route of getting to Cebu. So I am actually at a depart, but I'm gonna be on a boat, okay? It's gonna be a ship. I've never done this in my life. I didn't even know they had a ship. Somebody told me about it. I said, oh, I'm definitely gonna go try that. It's gonna take me 24 hours to get to Cebu. My flight was, my departure was supposed to be at four. They went and put it at 11 p.m. Grab some snacks and let's see. So I got, I got the business class, I believe, which is like one for without a bunk bed or anything. It's just for me. And I get my own desk and a bathroom and you have to pay for internet services, what I was told. But let's check it out and see what it is. This is gonna be my first time on the road to Cebu. Salam to everybody. And this is gonna be interesting. I don't like boats and I don't like planes because Titanic and for planes, I saw a couple movies I didn't like. So I don't like turbulence, but we'll see how this boat goes. Y'all ready for Wally's journey? Okay, so I just found out when you guys buy the ticket, just remember as soon as you buy the ticket, make sure you go to the terminal fee counter. And what the terminal fee counter does is you still have to pay the terminal fee when going on a ship. So I pay like, like over a thousand pesos. So now I have to pay another 104 pesos to get on the ship. Just remember that when you get over here. But I do have my luggage and I think that's free because it's a ship so we'll see but this is going to be very interesting so i hope you guys are ready i do get three meals and we'll see how the internet works over here but 24 hours on a boat and it's the cheapest boat in all of the philippines to take okay i don't know what i got myself into but yo this is crazy honestly i think this is going to be a little fun a little new for me and i've never been on a boat to go I've never been on a cruise ship ever. So it's gonna be like a little relaxation of R&R. &R. Um, traveling gets you tired, so I'll take my bed, eat some good food, and relax and see what the first class amenities are at this boat. But this is crazy, look at this thing. This is insane, look at it. That's so cool. Yo, so, never seen a boat this big but it's kind of cool hello sir thank you look at that they even have like there's a truck coming out of it i've never seen it so this is gonna be my first time ever checking it out really cool never saw it. hey hey how you doing guys how you doing everybody always good to see the hospitality of the philippines i hope the hospitality is the same in cebu i'm excited so let me uh let me see what it's about I love this journey. I really do. Check this out, y'all. Yo, look at that. That's so cool. So, first time on a boat. Once we get up there, we'll see what my room is going to look like. I'll show you what kind of meals we get and see what's going to happen. I've never been on a boat. This is going to be my first time ever on a boat. I guess I got to climb these stairs. So, we're going to go through. Wish me luck. So, I'm actually pretty excited. I don't know if we can leave that here. I hope not, but we'll see. So I gotta, I guess we have to climb the stairs. See what it is. Do we take it up? I'm not sure. So everyone's going up with their luggage, so I'm not really sure. This is gonna be very interesting. But uh, let's check it out. All right, so I had to climb that the whole time. Now I gotta look for my room. Excuse me. I had to carry that like like 15 flights of stairs. Alright. Here we go. There you go. Thank you. Just wait for a one Just wait? Okay, where do I wait? Anywhere here? Okay. Alright. Thank you. Thank you. So they actually, they actually put me here. As you can see, three, three floors. They have a gift shop and they told me I had to wait. So first time I had to wait, but they got a salon. Like really? Those are the rooms. I mean, they even have like drinks. It's gonna be kind of interesting. I'm actually excited. We'll see. But uh, I mean, you pay less than like $20 to get your own room. 
and you get VIP treatment. So we'll see. I love the Philippines. They're about to show me my room, excuse me. And uh, that's kind of cool. They brought me like a personal person to show me the room. There is a shower area for business class solo. It's located here. Okay. Dining area is Cafe at Right. So business class, that's what you guys want to get is business class. Mr. Wally, yes. Business class solo. Awesome. Perfect. And you said where's the restrooms? Restroom I Out outside on those doors? Yes. Okay, so we just go over there to use the restroom and that's it. Okay, perfect. Here's your ticket to be shown when you get your meal. Your free meal will start at breakfast tomorrow. Okay. 6 a.m. up to 8. Okay. And here is your room key. Awesome. Just one valid ID. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, and this is it. So you got AC, which is great. I got AC, I got a little sink, and I have a little tiny bed, and that's it, ladies and gentlemen. Put your stuff here, charge your stuff, very small for business class, okay? But I'm actually glad that I got the business class. I don't gotta share a room with anybody. Bathrooms are on the other side. So we're gonna go check this boat out and see what else it has. But this is pretty cool. I get three few meals. Tomorrow my meal will start at around eight o'clock or six to eight o'clock breakfast. But it is what it is. Hopefully the internet will be good and I'll be sitting here just watching Netflix. But this is it, this is what you get. So, so far, so good. Very small. But it works, it works. Fortunately, I gotta go pe like use the bathroom somewhere else, which I'll figure out. But it's really cool in this room. This AC, yes. So far, yes. Yes. Cool thing about it is it does have a cafeteria. And then I'm gonna go up to the top floor and see what I see upstairs. There's a third floor, so we'll see. Oh. Get upstairs. And... Let's see. I think you can go outside. Yo! So that's the emergency exit. I think you can keep it outside. But everybody's outside as you can see. I don't know if I can go out. Can I? Yeah. So, here you go. Wow. So, I'm on the top of the deck. And you can see all of the, uh, if you look at it, it's kind of cool. You have all of the water and if you want to take like a cool little Instagram picture, this is where you go, right next to the uh, port. But look at it, really nice. So in the morning, whenever you want, and you can go over here um, and see the whole view. Look at that, that's so cool. So if you ever take a boat, this is the way to go. Like, you want something that's really comfortable, but look at that, super beautiful. It's already on and you can see the whole port area super nice the lights are on really cool little vibe i like it it's kind of cool that i only like you i only paid like about almost two thousand pesos which is almost like like 20 20 23 dollars american um us dollars so this is the opportunity you want to take to kind of see how it is you know look at it it's the dock that's it it's really nice see everybody hanging out over here and that's it this is what you get it's, it's very romantic if you take a girlfriend but unfortunately I don't have a girlfriend so there's no romance here but there it is right there and then they have a beautiful church over there so there you go you guys get the view of like so far everything and then tomorrow once we wake up I'll tell you how the internet is and I'll see how the breakfast is hopefully the breakfast is a lot uh, like I hope it's a good breakfast um, but I did bring some snacks and I'll check out the internet and see what else they have But so far good experience really nice to be on a ship deck for the very first time I feel fancy, but this is the cheapest boat you can get all the Philippines for the price of a business class And that's awesome. It's me going back in And you also have full-on AC system so the AC feels really good now I'm going back to my room relaxing and I'll see you guys tomorrow morning Okay, so let me show you guys the room. First of all, just so you know, this place does have snacks. They're very reasonable, um, but look how comfy this is. If you're a tall guy like me, I'm about six foot tall. Woo, you got lighting right here. 
think it works or maybe it doesn't work okay maybe we have to wait till we've uh we set sail <laughs> i was about to say take flight um i don't know if like anything works here for electricity let's see nope okay so that means we have to set sail to have everything work that's why people are charging their phones so make sure you have your phone charged we don't take off till like 11 so right now um i thought it was it's nine o'clock so we just have to wait till we take off um if anything does change i thought i was going to sleep but i had to get some snacks and stuff but they do have internet and i think you can upgrade so i'm going to wait to see what they say about the internet but i mean this is what you get i mean it's comfy and it's a non-smoking room so and the ac is hitting just so you know the coke zeros are sitting there because i want them cold so obviously when you're in the philippines it's humid so right when you step out the cokes are not cold anymore so uh we'll see how it goes but i mean you can hang your clothes uh you get like a sink you can brush your teeth you get areas where you can actually uh link up stuff um you get a nice little area over here as well no cable no tv unfortunately but i did take the wrong room there's a bigger room than this but whoever gave me the wrong information it's the wrong room but it is what it is it's great for a traveler it's just me, so that's is all I need for 24 hours. The very interesting part about this cruise ship is there's an actual live band, which is ridiculous. You guys gotta see this. This is crazy. I couldn't believe it. So, while people are eating and just enjoying their food, by the way, the food looks really good. It's like rice chicken everything but here's the funny part there's a live band so you can eat and listen to live band and i've also had elevators so you can also ask for like an upgrade so i'm waiting to see if i can get an upgraded room but they're about to do a whole band show a couple things i need to warn you guys um make sure you charge your phone that's number one because the the uh cords right now they don't work so the outlets don't work and there is snacks on the ship so you don't have to worry about snacks if you want snacks if you want healthier options they have some healthy options but even the cafeteria is open so check it out and see like what else options they are but i mean they have everything you need so so far i mean it's a great show and we're gonna enjoy it and vibe out but uh i want to see what this band's about to play but obviously i don't want to get uh i don't want to get in trouble by youtube so i'm going to stay away from the band because they're probably going to uh sing copyrighted music so i'm gonna stay away from that but so far so cool great great vibe and we'll see what happens next but as you guys can see there's three floors and it's really huge that's the first floor second floor has the cafeteria and the third floor is just where you can get on deck which is awesome and they have an elevator so if you're lazy and you want to take the elevator you can take the elevator we'll see what happens next so funny story i asked for an upgrade they said there was three people ahead of me there's one room None of them showed up, so they gave me the room. So we're about to get a little upgrade and show you the best room in this whole ship right now. I hope you guys are ready. So as you guys can see, they didn't show up, so they gave me the room, so I got the upgrade. But the only bad part is we have no internet for 24 hours, which is killer. Which I hope Claire can fix. I'm hoping you're joking. I really am. I got to fix that last Aha! There's no internet for 24 hours. This is gonna be fun. At least there's a restaurant and there's music in the background as you guys can hear. But I'll show you guys the room in a minute. Okay, so I paid about an extra $58 for this room. And I just wanna show you guys what the room is gonna look like. So hopefully you guys, I'm, I hope I'm surprised. And there you go. Oh wow, it's actually pretty big. Okay. Oh, it's hot in here. Oh, okay. I love. I the. I was the. Oh, thank God! I was like, uh, please tell me the AC is working. Yeah. Oh, you're awesome. It's oh, this is cool. Okay. Wait. Do I got? Oh my God! I got a window. Oh, this is cool. Maybe my internet will work here. That's awesome. So I have a window, AC. I even have a TV. I have two beds, and that's pretty cool. And I got a phone that's probably not going to be used. And they have a cool little bathroom. So they gave me, oh, it's a tiny little bathroom. Really tiny. Okay. All right, now to get my stuff and bring everything over here and uh, transfer everything over. So I'll see you guys soon. All right, ladies and gentlemen, 
Welcome to the new room. Impressive. Okay, so we have two beds. Let's show you the room. Let's see how comfy. Oh my God, they are actually a lot different. They're very comfy. You have a ceiling light. You can actually increase that. There's an alarm. There's a speaker, you can hear it. They even got a night light and a foot light. Hold up, hold up. How do we turn this off? So let's turn this off. Let's turn this off. What is it, bed? Where's the light? Hold up. Okay, ceiling light. It doesn't work. Okay. Foot light? Oh, okay, cool. Little foot light at night. Okay, you can see it turn off. You got a night light. I don't know where the night light is supposed to go, but let's just turn this back on. Okay, there's the ceiling light. Okay, so you have ceiling light. Let there be light. Full on AC system. Okay, I do have a TV. Now that I found out I have no internet, that sucks for 24 hours, okay? I wish I had internet, but maybe my phone will get service. Maybe. I think we're already out of here. Um, oh, they gave me a fridge. Okay, as you guys know, wait, is it cold? No, it's not on. Why is it not on? Why is this fridge not on? Okay, well, it's not on, sadly, but it is what it is, okay? We got a closet, okay. They even got air freshener. Um, I'm guessing this is for turning off. Okay, so I can turn all this off. It's kind of cool, they give me window lights, okay? All right, bathroom time. All right, we got a toilet with a butt cleaner. We got a cool little tiny shower. Um, it's very hot in here, but as you can see. Okay, so as I was trying to get the bathroom, as you guys can see, there is a shower, there is a bunch of stuff that you're good. Um, they even have something to wipe your butt, which is awesome. The only thing I did notice in the other room that I wanna give you guys a heads up, there is no blanket. So when you come to the other room, the one I was in in the beginning, which is kind of cool, so I saw best of both worlds. There was no blanket in that one. They don't give you a blanket nor a towel and your shower is on the outside, so, and it's, it's not clean. So, overall great. Let's see the views. Did we already sail shit? We haven't even sailed yet, so, I'm kind of shocked we haven't sailed yet. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Cool thing is, um, it's finally moving, so we're already out of here. So, overall, beautiful, and, comfy bed oh my god yes 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 this is yo this is what I'm talking about I'm so excited for this so I love you guys tomorrow we're gonna go get some breakfast and then we land in beautiful Cebu um, I hope you guys enjoyed the experience so far but we still have more to come so I'll see you guys soon good morning everybody well very interesting Good sleep, still tired, probably gonna go back to sleep. Felt a little sick, but check this out. I am in a beautiful view with, I mean a little romantic today. So when you have business class, which I have, um, you can actually stay at the restaurant. I didn't want the restaurant. So I went ahead and got it to go, okay? With this romantic view, we're gonna make this a very amazing breakfast. So. Breakfast, pretty simple. This is what you get. You get rice, okay? A huge load of rice, two chicken patties, and some eggs, and a coffee, and I paid extra for a juice. So just so you know, I paid a little extra just to have it to my room. Mm. Rice is plain. It is what it is, but mm. eggs. Eggs are cold, not fresh. Still good though, but still cold. Um, chicken patty. Regular chicken patty, actually pretty good. Mm. And that's what you get with the romantic view. Mm. How do you like it, sweetheart? Oh yeah, that's right, I'm still single. But, I love you guys, and I will show you what is in store for us for lunch today. Because after I eat this, I'm going back to sleep.
because they woke us up exactly the way it was like the purge. They woke us up with the sound too, and they did a little prayer, and I woke up, I was like, I better get breakfast. Got breakfast, now I'm going back to sleep. Good experience so far. Coolest thing about this, a fisherman. Are you serious? This man is fishing in the middle of the ocean. We are in the middle of nowhere and he is out here fishing, bro. That is so cool. And ladies and gentlemen, I know you can't see me because of the sun, but I can show you something cool. And this is the sea. Look at that. It's so cool because you got the sun on this side, so it's very bright, so I do apologize, but look how beautiful that is. I'm out in the, um, the ocean, but you can see everything here. And as you can see, it's so beautiful and it's a scenic route. So like you see the mountains over here, it's pretty cool. Like, honestly, <clears throat> I'm losing my voice a little bit, but it is what it is. But it's really nice, right? Like you can't say, for what you you get what you pay for, you know what I mean? How beautiful is that? And we still have a couple more hours to go. We are <clears throat> down to about seven hours, inshallah. So I'll see you guys soon. Very sunny, still hot, and uh, it's not cold. That's awesome. Look at that, so beautiful, beautiful. Okay, now it's time for lunch. <laughs> So when you have business to like, you don't have to wait in line. Over here, they allow you to go to this cafe because you don't have to wait in line in that line. So this is the cafe. So I just got to get into the cafe and see. And then that's, and then once the cafe works, we go inside and, uh, and then we eat here. So hopefully the lunch is actually pretty good. And so you don't have to wait in line. So they just sit you down. We'll see. Oh, I guess I guess they they skip me. It is what it is. All right, so we just wait. So I finally sat down and I got my food. They gave me rice, chicken, and a salad. Um, let's see, chicken is like a. Like a curry base, I guess. Never had it. Let's see. Yes, sir. Thank you. What kind of soup is that? Uh, mushroom soup. Oh, thank you. They give you soup too. It's not bad. At least the um, the rice is warm. Chicken's okay. Now let's try the uh, the mushroom soup. <clears throat> I'm not a big fan of like uh, like that kind of chicken. I like like with no bones. Salad, I'm not a fan. Rice, I'm rice, I'm always a fan of. Mushroom soup usually looks a little different. Thank you. They gave me a cracker. I don't know. Wait, okay, the mushrooms. The mushroom soup slaps. That's actually actually really good. I mean, it doesn't have like the texture of mushroom soup, but you put a little bit of rice in there, and it slaps. Mm. Overall, good. The good thing about the business uh, select is you don't gotta wait in line. That's what I like about it. Overall, really good on the mushroom soup. I could probably order another one of these. I don't know what this is, but we're gonna see. Mini, like it's a mini, um, like a mini cake. It's like dessert. Actually, really good. Mushroom soup, the rice, 
and the dessert, really good. I finished all of it. Mm. I wasn't a fan of the chicken. I wasn't a fan of the vegetables. The rice was good overall. I would have just done the soup and that dessert. Pretty good. Not chicken and the other stuff. Okay, so lunch wasn't Hi. like what? It, hello, hello, hello. That girl is so sweet to me. Um, lunch was okay. I wasn't expecting it to be. I'd stay away from the chicken. The salad was no. Um, the soup and just the uh, the soup and just the uh, rice was good. But that's about it. Like nothing else was really good. So now back to my room. Got a cup of ice for my Coke Zero to wash off that uh, chicken that wasn't that great. So I, I, I didn't like it too much. I, I wasn't a fan of the chicken at all. And we're off to the sea, my lady. I wonder what's for dinner. Cause we got till eight and I'm already thinking about dinner. That's pretty bad. Ladies and gentlemen, we have finally made it to Cebu. And I'm super excited. Oh, is this a bridge? Oh, wow. Sorry for the dirty mirror. But as you guys can see, we finally made it to Cebu. Super excited. And we have made it 24 hours on a ship. This is the first time I've ever been on this ship. Still got to get used to the motion. If you get motion sickness, it could possibly do that to you. Um, the food was overall like a basic six or a five but i mean the hospitality of just the people were so kind um trying to turn off this tv you only get one channel on this tv but uh overall great time i loved it and we're about to leave got everything packed inshallah and i hope you guys are ready because we're about to get on board to cebu <laughs> super excited look at this this is so cool. Look at it. It's another city. Um, I guess it's I guess it's city vibe, just like kind of like Manila. But wow, it's like the views. It reminds me of San Francisco with the bridge, which is kind of awesome. Shouts out to the bay. Um, but yeah, we're almost here. So let's check out. Once we get out, we'll see uh, how it looks on the pier. All right, so we finally made it. As you can see, we're about to depart. Uh, I can't wait to get out. But as you can see, everybody's leaving. So it's been really good. And uh, we are out of here, out of the vessel. 24 hours on a ship is very tough, especially when you have anxiety like me. It was 24 hours. So very happy that I got out of here. Thank you. Oh, oh thank you. And uh, she also gave me your number if I need a tour guide. So inshallah. So I'll see you guys soon while he's journey over now. And you guys have a wonderful day. I'll see you guys soon. Remember to live your life to the fullest because tomorrow is never promised. Over now, Wally's journey on the next one.